Welcome to Pavitra Laptop Care. Today's topic is logic gates. You know, this logic gates topic is very very important because any kind of charging IC or RAM IC or controller IC, I.O. or processor will work using logic gates. These all are based on Boolean algebra. Okay, I will explain what is that Boolean algebra and what is logic gates, how it works. Okay, one by one I will explain. Now, the logic gates. A logic gate is a device that acts as a building block for digital circuits. It's very important in digital circuits. Okay, they perform basic logical functions that are fundamental to digital circuits. For example, smartphone, computers and any other digital circuits. In a circuit, logic gates will make decisions based on a combination of digital signals combining from its input. It accepts some in inputs, I mean input as the signals, then it gives appropriate outputs. Most logic gates have two input and one output, or some gates having three or more. Logic gates are based on Boolean algebra. Just now I told it's based on Boolean algebra. At any given moment, every terminal is in one of the two binary conditions false or true okay false represents 0 and 2 represents 1 depending on the type of logic gate being used and the combination of inputs the binary output will differ it may be 1 or it may be 0 it depends on their inputs types of logic gates <coughs> there are seven basic logic gate circuits and R, NOT, NAND, NOR, XR, XNOR. In this particular topic, I am going to explain only AND, R and NOT. In next chapter, I will explain remaining one. AND gate. AND gate will give the output as high or true if all input logic signals are high or present. Okay. In case two or more signals will be in high condition, then only the output will be high in particular AND gate. Okay, if one or more logical signals are low and others are high, then the condition will be low. The output will be low. Okay, here is the symbol of AND gate. Okay, next AND gate truth table. So here. Uh, I am using a N channel transistor to understand better. Okay, here how it will act in case of two inputs and what will be the output. See, for example, if I give A transistor and this one is B transistor, if A transistor will be 0, okay, and B will be 1, then output will be 0. Okay, next A will be 1 and B transistor input will be means base will be high then it will conduct and gives the output as a 0. Right. In case of A will be 1 means high and B will be 1 means high in case of both transistors are high or logically it is a true then output also true or presents. See, it's a one. Okay, this is the truth table of AND gate. Okay, next OR gate. A gate will give the output as a high or true if any one or more logical signals are high or present. See, it contains two inputs. In case of two or three or four any one will be high then the output will give the high or present or true okay this is the <coughs> symbol of R gate see for R gate so what will be the input and what will be the output how it gives the output that I'll show you now 
here a will be high okay a transistor will be high and b transistor will be low then what will happen either a or b is a high then the output will be high okay if a transistor input will be low and b transistor input will be high then what will be the result as i told any one will be high then output also will be high okay in case both the transistor base will be high means input will be high obviously the output also will be high okay this is the truth table of or gate next not gate not gate having usually only one input and gives only one output a <laughs> not gate this is the not gate the output is a high okay then it gives the reverse function okay the input voltage will be low or vice versa in case input will be high then output will be low okay this is the symbol of not gate here not will be there okay now i'll explain you see this is the supply this is the current flow it is directly given to the output when the base will be zero okay see the input will be high then output will be zero and output will be, uh, will be zero sorry input will be zero then output will be high now if input will be high the output will be zero it is connected to the ground in case input will be zero then it won't conduct here directly it given to the output hi okay this is the truth table of not get now i hope you understand and r and r not get okay what are those and uh, what are the truth table and how it functions see the other gate will be developed in the upcoming class prior to that i will discuss how a charging ic will function using logic gates initially i told so all the ic's all charging ic's and processor or controller ic's will work using these gates that is the reason this chapter is very very important to you okay now i will explain how it's very important in charging ic here i have taken an example of bq24780s it's a very famous charging ic in this some people will get confused what uh, what is the ac okay it will be high or it will be low okay sometimes it gives low you know what is the reason let's come i'll explain see in usually in ac okay path 3.3 volts will be there sometimes it gives ground because internally logic gates will be there in case if their their i mean their inputs will be low or it won't satisfy then you will get the ac okay low okay now see this is the black uh, it is the function black diagram of bq24780s okay here these are comparator 1 2 3 4 i will explain you in future uh, i mean in upcoming uh, chapters what are the comparator okay just generally you can assume it this will compare two inputs and gives the output here positive if positive is more than the negative input then it gives the positive result in case negative will be more than the positive then it gives negative result that that much only you can understand now so now here 3.2 volts is given to the positive and vcc vcc obviously 19.5 volts will be there okay that one given to the negative so just now i explained you which one is higher that output will come so here 19.5 volts negative is the higher than the 3.2 uh, volts right so that's the reason here result will be low okay the output of this comparator will be low it passes to and gate but before that one not will be there it means it's a not gate okay not gate already explained you in case input will be low then it will convert it as a high 
it means this and get input of one input is high okay we will check other uh, other input here one more comparator the positive is given to the ac detect and negative is given uh, sorry negative is given to the 0.6 volts ac detect usually 2.6 volts will be there because of voltage divider okay here 2.6 is greater than 0.6 volts so result will be positive means high okay logically high so then this and get having two high inputs then the result will be high okay high in the sense it's a region region will be high okay 6 volts you will get the region so this output is connected to other and get input this is a one leg okay other two legs are so is there see one leg is given to and get i mean from the and get the output of other and get is given to the input of this particular and get okay let us check this one is high or low okay here also two comparator are used use, use here so here one comparator positive is has given to the voltages vcc it's a 19.5 volts other negative is 26 volts obviously negative is the bigger than the positive right so the result will be negative means 20 volts means high sorry uh, low negative in the sense it's a low okay here it goes to the and gate of the input but before this one not will be there not in the sense in case this input will be low then it convert it as a high so it means this and gate having high input one input is high okay let us check other input here this comparator positive has given to ac detect okay ac detect already i told you it's a 2.6 volts will be there and here 2.4 volts be in negative it compares and it gives the positive result you know 2.6 volts is greater than 2.4 volts so that's the reason you will get high see this and get having both the inputs are high then it gives the output also high right this is the and gate and gate function if you forget so please come back and you can check here this one input is high this uh, uh, this input also high and this srn will be high okay by default it will be high so here three inputs are high then and get output also will be high correct so it will be true these are our logic gates i clearly told you it was only zeros and ones high or low here the result will be high then it goes to other not gate already clearly i told you not is the inverse output it gives see here is the high then the output will be low right in case if it is a high signal will be there then it connects to the ground or it makes it's a low okay then if it is a low here it's a n channel mosfet has given here see this one is very very important please note down here this is n channel mosfet right in this n channel mosfet if gate voltage will be there then this ac ok already i told you ac ok will be 3.3 volts that goes to the ground right drain to source connectivity will be there and then it will become a ground means it's a low but here after this not gate it's a low right so low in the sense this gate will be off condition then it won't conduct it will be in off condition so that's the reason ac ok will be 3.3 .3. okay according to this formula in case if all voltages are there in case of this particular ic is working fine and it's giving i mean it receiving appropriate voltages then ac ok will be high condition in case one of the this comparator will be input will be false in case abnormal voltage it gives i mean it receives then ac ok becomes low understood my point for example ac detect it's a 2.6 usually it has to come in case it reduces to 2.4 or 2.3 then this will be false 
then you will get ac over k as a low okay that's it uh, this is the one second i'm telling you repeatedly i'm telling you this is very 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 important in case of transistor sorry in case of uh, processor or uh, uh, what is that ic charging ics or any kind of ics uh, topic will come now in that case this will gives a ma major role okay so thank you thank you everyone and uh, in this video so uh, i want to say thanks to all who are giving support directly and indirectly uh, okay nothing else okay thank you thank you very much